we don't seem to be on that trajectory at the moment. Uh, all of the evidence shows that there are still you know, vast numbers of coal plants being built around the world today. And so my concern is to try and make sure that we're using the best technology and that we do things like work more on carbon capture and storage because with those plants being built today, we need to make sure that we've got the technology solutions for them to try and get ourselves to, to that Paris Agreement commitment. I'm not a climate scientist or an expert on those things, so um, you know, I don't have the, the expertise to analyse that, but my, my interest is about making sure that we're using the technologies that reduce emissions from coal today, uh, and that's why we're focused on the high efficiency plants, and then I'm really interested in making sure that we do things like work more on carbon capture and storage, because with the plants that are being built today, the plants that are going to be operating into the future, it's essential that we look at how we can uh, deploy CCS on them in the future. No, because I think we can eliminate the emissions from coal. Uh, that's why we're advocating for the role of carbon capture and storage. It's not the uh, it's not coal that's the problem. It's the emissions that are the problem. So you know, we need to address those emissions. And if we can address those emissions, if we can get the technology solutions in place to remove those emissions from coal, then the solution is there.